1939, when Britain was on the brink of World War II, and the nation prayed and waited for peace with honor. I am speaking to you from the cabinet room at 10 Downing Street. When all we stood for was in peril, one Englishman above all others inspired the free world. And another great Englishman dared to cry out from the darkness. Come down here and fight, I'm maining! Come on! Come on, come on, it's over it! I'm gonna die, I've died in my bed. Look, you silly movie! You all right? No! I'm not the bleeding... You've never seen Alf like this. They're only supposed to come out on clear nights! Now Britain's most colourful character, Alf Garnet, is bigger, better and funnier on the big screen in Till Death Us Do Part. Warren Mitchell is Alf Garnet, the proud father. You love your daddy, don't you? Hey? Eh? Oh, shut up! The great lover. Dandy Nichols, his wife. Don't be daft. See, hey! Anthony Booth, his son-in-law. Una Stubbs, his loving daughter. Look, get off of her, you ran his casket! Garnet, the tolerant father. Garnet, the astute politician. What a bloody Harold Wilson are about running this country, then! Well, I'd sooner have Wilson running the country than that soppy grammar school twitty. Garnet, defender of the faith. I'm oh. as religious as anybody else is. I've been to church. Twice. Look, Mike's mum goes every Sunday. Look, I said I was religious. Didn't say I was a bloody religious maniac. Garnet, the intrepid sportsman. <laughs> He's catastrophic. No, he's goodness! He's patriotic. He's a bloody Russian linesman, isn't he? I remember Stalin! Always ready to lend a helping hand. Watch it comes off. Ah! Yes! The coon got this to you, Moosey, eh? <laughs> Till death us do part is part of our history, a family saga. <laughs> In peace. Uh, oh. He ruined mine, too. In war, for anyone who's ever had his back up against a wall, those famous last words, till death us do part.